complex building so far to date. It's a part of complex in the Upper East Side. It's a place where the community can really reflect on my truthness. But there's one thing missing. I need a church. That's where you come in. You have the next two weeks and $20,000 designed me the most elaborate, most beautiful building in the world. This is going to be a building that's beyond anything we've seen so far. You up for the task? Let's go. is definitely the toughest one yet. I've never had to plan a building before, so I know I'll have to find people who know church architecture and drafting. I know I can produce work that Mr. Trump will be pleased with, but I also know that I'll have to put in a lot of time, effort, and a lot of work. I'm prepared to do that. Man, 20,000 bucks, man. I feel like I've won already. All right, I, I know some folks who can probably come over and help me out, and you know, help me spend my money right, and get the project done. But man, twenty thousand bucks! There ain't no way Stacy is walking away as a steward. Everybody was kung fu fighting. Those kids were fast as lightning. In fact, it was a little bit frightening. But they fought with. Trump's money on blackjack. I've got no project. But the Don's cool, man. He'll understand it was Vegas. Okay, you had two weeks and twenty thousand dollars to build my church. I want to see the biggest and best there is. Stacy, show me what you got. Hey Mr. Trump, I put a lot of hard work into this and I think you'll be very pleased. Here is your We interrupt this program to bring you an important message from Pastor Marco Smith. Matthew 25, verse 14, Jesus said, Again, it will be like a man going on a journey, who had called his servants and entrusted his property to them. To one he gave five talents of money, to another two talents, and to another one talent, each according to his ability. Then he went on his journey. The man who had received the five talents went at once and put his money to work and gained five more. So also the one with two talents gained two more, but the one man who had received the one talent went off, dug a hole in the ground, and hid his master's money. 
after a long time the master, the master of the servants returned and settled accounts with them. The man who had received the five talents brought the other five. Master, he said, you entrusted me with five talents. See, I have gained five more. His master replied, well done, good and faithful servant. You have been faithful with a few things. I will put you in charge of many things. Come and share your master's happiness. The man with the two talents also came. Master, he said, you entrusted me with two talents. See, I have gained two more. His master replied, well done, good and faithful servant. You have been faithful with a few things. I will put you in charge of many things. Come and share your master's happiness. Then the man who had received the one talent came. Master, he said, I know that you are a, man, a hard man, harvesting where you have not sown and gathering where you have not scattered seed. So I was afraid and went out and hid your talent in the ground. See, here is what belongs to you. His master replied, you wicked, lazy servant. So you knew that I harvest where I have not sown and gather where I have not scattered seed. Well then, you should have put my money on deposit with the bankers so that when I returned, I would have had that I would have received it back with interest. Take the talent from him and give it to the one who has the 10 talents. For everyone who has will be given more and he will have an abundance. Whoever does not have, even what he has will be taken from him. And throw that worthless servant outside into the darkness where there will be weeping and gnashing of teeth. Thank you. We now return you to your regularly scheduled program already in progress. Whoa, Stacy, that was very impressive. Eric, show me what you got. Hold, hold on, hold, hold on. Just wait a minute. Hold, hold on. Like this. Hold on. Church? I gave you twenty thousand dollars. I gave you two weeks, and this what is what you, you come up with. Dude, I, I was like, I was coming no, back. There's no more excuses. No, I don't know three, no. where did my money go. What you, what you spend what? it on? This is, this is, this. What is this? Okay, okay. It's like this is a joke. The, security, get this bum out of here. Eric, you're fired. Congratulations, Stacy. You've been a project manager 11 times, and each time come out on top. You've exceeded every one of my expectations. You have proven from time and time again that you are the steward.